My pleasure anytime. <laughs> so, yeah. Jane! Please do, я сказал. Окей. Ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. Here we are with Anna Drubic in her studio. Thank you so much. Thanks for coming. The first question about the piece you are composing or arranging for following K-17 concert. So tell us a little bit. Uh, there will be two pieces performed on the concert. Um, One is a um, etude uh, for forehand piano. Um, it, it, this one is for, from a cycle called Her Dances, which I composed a couple of years ago. And the other one piece is called um, Air Alert for String Quartet. This is going to be first performance in, for String Quartet of this piece. Okay, great. And Air Alert is... is um, oh piece uh, a reflection on um uh, on a war that that is now happening in ukraine and it's already two years we're living in this in this um hell and, and situation and somehow we we can we we don't stop reading news of every every day's attacks uh, and somehow when when i got an idea of writing a Piece. Uh, the the only thing I could think of was like the air air alert, and uh, so <laughs> this is going to be performed on the, um, on February 10th. Okay, great. And as I know, you have uh, traditional music education, so music schools and conservatory or high school, whatever. And you was pretty successful in piano playing and playing piano. Why did you switch to composition? Why? You started scoring well yeah i started as a as a uh, classical pianist and were were concentrated on it but somehow when i was uh, about 14 or, or 15 years old i was like very very much interested in composition and somehow my my whole childhood i was i was uh, improvising and playing some some music of I guess mine, um, and um, my father, who who was a very great and, and famous film director, um, at some point, like kind of noticed this this desire of mine and and uh, talked to his friend, uh, genius composer Isaac Schwartz, uh, to to teach me to to give me some introduction in composition. So. When I was 15, I uh, we kind of spent uh, summer together with this very old composer. He was about 80 years old by then, and he used to be a student of Shostakovich. And uh, he kind of started to give me this introduction, introduction lessons in composition, and somehow this this uh, inspired me and like fascinated me so much that. Since then, I kind of started sw switching more and more in composition, and by the age of like I don't I don't recall maybe eighteen or nineteen, I was totally sure that I don't want to be a, a classical pianist. I'm more interested in creating music than like performing someone else's music. Um, yeah. So your first uh, director, the first director you worked with, was your father. So how was it like? Well, uh, well, first of all, he was my father, but also like I can now uh, honestly say that he was uh, the greatest director from from all among the directors I worked with. So I could say from then it was like downhill. <laughs> well, you worked with some I, love, I worked a people. lot, but but he was a real artist, real um, uh, real giant of art that somehow when you just talk to him and and like not even about work or music but in general you, you're like in some sort of conversation with him with him you just i don't know you kind of feel this overall artistic flight and that that kind of just gives you new ideas and and i don't know like You, you want to be creative you want to 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 do to do something create some art um with with majority of of uh, directors it's a very interesting um communication but usually it's 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 less it's less 
free, it's less creative, but it's, it's more about the structure mm -hmm. of the movie or to storytelling and so on and so on. So what is your favorite? You're composing for movies, for theatrical, you just recently had your theatrical debut yes. on the Broadway, and for a concert, so is there anything you'll like to do the most to compose? I've... And if so, why? I think honestly, I'm just uh, I I just need to composing music as is some sort of like a therapy for me. So somehow it you does, compose music as a therapy for you. Yes, and somehow it doesn't really mm -hmm. matter for what I, I I write it. I love writing for concert hall. Uh, maybe this is my favorite thing. But Are you in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, all the time. The dog. This is my <laughs> therapy dog or like okay. service dog. Um, uh, emotional support. So, okay. so I, 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 I like writing for concert hall. I really enjoyed it. It was my kind of almost second or third experience writing for theater. It's totally different. Um, process but i also liked it uh movies i i can say like i, I did a bunch already and um but any every time with a new director is totally new 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 experience i see and now you're in la and there is downsides and the bright sides of the city so what do you like and what do you dislike about los angeles mm, it's a good question can i can tell many things I dislike about LA but the funny thing that I noticed that every time I come from the places that I really like back to LA I still enjoy coming back to LA this is a very unique thing about this town uh, I can't explain why it's just this 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 way of of living and feeling myself in this in this city somehow already is my I would say like feeling home <laughs> and if not la where oh there's so many wonderful places i love i love um i love italy i love uh, france i really liked australia i was recently there so there are many places to check out i love russia but <laughs> we'll do, <laughs> we all do. Uh... If you would have a chance to have a lunch with any composer of any time, who would it be? And there are many composers I would like to have lunch, better to have drinks <laughs> with. Um, but the, the number one probably would be John Lennon. I would like to really? have yes, wow. drinks with him. Uh, drinks and drugs, I can drinks. imagine. <laughs> yeah. Okay, thank you so much. We're so much looking forward to perform and to listen to your piece. Thank you for coming, Kivgeni. <laughs> Bye. My pleasure. <laughs>